Maybe I need to tell my fortune. Hi, everybody. I know that many of you don't know who I am. I am Pastor Dawn, and I am usually here in the morning. I do many of the same things Pastor Jen does. Uh, but I'm really happy that I'm able to worship with you this morning. And so we're going to talk a little bit, and then I'm going to read you a story. Okay? Does that sound good? Is that okay? Yeah. Okay. So how many of you know what a wish is? You ever make a wish, maybe, on your birthday? Maybe you blow out the candles, or maybe not. Thank you. <laughs> um, a wish is something that you really, really want, right? A wish is something that you hope for. Like when I was, when I was little, I wished for a pony. Anybody wish for a pony? Ever wish for a pony? Or sometimes, another thing I wished for was a puppy. Or another time, I wished that we could go to Disney World. I wished to go to Disney World. And that was when there was just the Magic Kingdom, way back in the olden days. Well, another word we use for wish is to dream. Like we could say that Pastor Dawn dreamed of going to Disney World, and she dreamed of having a puppy, and she dreamed of having a pony. And you know what? Whatever your dreams are, I hope they come true. And you know what else? God has a dream. You ever think about God having a dream? You think about God having something that God really, really wishes for, really, really hopes for? Yeah. Well, I'm going to read you a story. Yes. You've read this book, I think. I think I don't. You don't. I know. Well, you're the man with the answers, aren't you? Maybe. <laughs> All right, let's read, and everybody else will be able to look at the pictures up there, right? Because Pastor Don only has one hand. Does anybody want to help me turn pages? Do I? Okay. What's your name? Joshua, you can help me turn pages, okay? So you help me, Joshua. Yeah, there we go. Let's hold it up so everybody can see, all right? All right, so here we go. It's called God's Dream, and it was written by Archbishop Desmond Tutu. Who knows? It was written by an Archbishop from South Africa, right? South Africa. Okay. Well, I'm going to read it. And then you can read it after the service, okay? All right. <laughs> Dear child of God, what do you dream about in your loveliest dreams? Do you dream about flying high or rainbows reaching across the sky? Okay, Joshua, turn the page. Do you dream about being free to do what your heart desires? or about being treated like a full person, no matter how young you might be. Do you know what God dreams about? If you close your eyes and look with your heart, I am sure, dear child, that you will find out. God dreams about people sharing. God dreams about people caring. God dreams that we reach out and hold one another's hands and play one another's games and laugh with one another's hearts. But God does not force us to be friends or to love one another, right? Dear child of God, it does happen that we get angry and hurt one another. Soon we start to feel sad and so very alone. Sometimes we cry, and God cries with us. But when we say we're sorry, 
and forgive one another, we wipe away our tears and God's tears too. Each of us carries a piece of God's heart within us. And when we love one another, the pieces of God's heart are made of gold. God dreams that every one of us will see that we are all brothers and sisters. Yes, even you and me. Even if we have different mommies and daddies or live in different faraway lands. Even if we speak different languages or have different ways of talking to God, even if we have different eyes or different skin. Even if you are taller and I am smaller, even if your nose is little and mine is large, dear child of God, do you know how to make God's dream come true? It is really quite easy. As easy as sharing, loving, caring, as easy as holding, playing, laughing, as easy as knowing we are family because we are all God's children. Will you help God's dream come true? Let me tell you a secret. God smiles like a rainbow when you do. Thank you, Joshua. So, let's help God smile like a rainbow, shall we? But not today, because we don't want any rain. Right <laughs> let's pray, okay? Let's pray. Dear God, thank you for helping us to be friends with one another because Jesus showed us how. And we pray that we will continue to make, a, make you happy and make your dream come true by the way we treat each other. Amen. Amen. Thank you very much.